Hey, what's going on guys? It's Two Shot here from Two Shot Gaming and today we are doing how to install Optifine for your Minecraft 1.8. If this shows exactly the same way how it installs from 1.8 to 1.2 to 1.3 all the way up to so they change the version to 1.9, I'll leave the video the same and just change the title for you guys. When it's 1.9, I'm going to make new videos for everybody so everybody kind of has up to date videos every few months instead of making one for every single version. Okay guys? If you could help me out, I want to try to go for 500 likes on this video too. You guys are doing a great job on uh, Forge. I'll leave a link if you guys need to learn how to install Forge. Right now, Optifine is not um, working with Forge right now. They'll have to come out with a Forge version. Same thing with too many items. And there's probably going to be a show on Sunday talking about... Um, it's a mod show talking about what mods are out for 1.8. So if you guys subscribe to the channel, check that out. All right? So first thing we're going to talk about today is what you have to do to install Optifine. First thing you're going to need, I know for some people, they already know all this stuff. And it's a little, it's a little um, redundant for them, but I, there's a lot of new people joining Minecraft right now, so I got to show this. You need something to move around the items. We're going to use WinRAR, or you can use 7-Zip. Go to WinRAR, download it, Windows 8, Windows 7, Vista, whatever you guys need it for. Download it. If you need to know how to actually use it, look up a video on YouTube. There's plenty of videos out there to show you how to use it. Same thing with 7-Zip. Just download it. It's an archive. It moves files around. makes stuff easy for you. Because your files are very big, you'll need to compress them from the work right. Those links will be in the description for you. Next thing you want to do, you want to go to Optifine, right? We need Optifine. Right now, or is it right now, Optifine is only ready for a single installation. It's not ready for Forge yet. The Forge thing is not working yet. So we got 1.8. It's 80% done. It will be 100% done too, soon. But right now, there's just a little things like um, texture, um, like um, connected with textures, parts, custom colors, this little like bug fixes, but it should work pretty good. And it will um, show you how to do it. So you want to go to here, uh, say 80% um, 80 done. Or maybe with the time you see this video, maybe it'll be a 90% or 100% because it gets really, really close to being done. So go to the download, download it. I'll take your air fly, skip the air, take it, put it on your desktop. So we need to have that. So we did all those things already. First thing we're going to do, I'm going to open on Minecraft. This is something that I know a lot of you guys already did. Make sure you go to profile. Make sure it says 1.8 released. Make sure you save that. Make sure you run it one time. You have to run this one time. If you don't run it one time, it's not going to work. Also, make sure your Minecraft is not running when you install. Let's do this. Let it go through the steps. We already did that. Just sign in and then log back out. Just quick game. So now we're back here. But you guys did the login. I didn't do that because I already did it. Then you want to take your Optifine. You want to right click open. This will take it to the installer. If that doesn't work, you can go open with Java. Take the installer. Right click, open with, choose the full program. Look at this area if it's not here. Look in this area if it's not here. Click browse. Go to Java. Click on there and you can look through all these things and you'll find it somewhere. I forgot. It's been so long since I had to find it. Just look up on how to find it to open it up on YouTube. That's how you'll find it. Just say, how do I find, um, open up with Java. But um, it's pretty easy. Just look for how to open up Java TM platform SE binary. It's really easy. It's a nice, simple video. So if you got it already set up, click on that. Click install. Optifine is successfully installed. It might take longer depending on your computer. Just so you guys know, sometimes it does. So you open it up. I'm not sure if this has bug fixes or not. I haven't tested this out yet. Optifine profile is already set up. That is nice. This actually sets up the profile for you. So you don't have to go to edit profile. It's already there. But for some reason, if it's not there, it'll probably be at the bottom with all these ones. But this one seems to be at the top. So look for the one that says release 1.8 Optifine and the version that you downloaded. Because it will be different versions of Optifine, a lot of you know. This is the ultra version, there's a light version, and there's like a middle version. I forgot what it's called. But make sure that's in there. It says Optifine 1.8. Hit save. Make sure it comes up down here so you know you're definitely on that one. 
And your name is profile, you can change that. Uh, Optifine, I mean, your profile name is Optifine. I guess you can change that if you want, but I don't know, it doesn't really matter. So hit play. When you hit play, you'll be taken to the Mojang screen. Everything will sign in. You go in, you just go to single player. You want to create a new world. And I don't know, we like to go in creative mode, right? Because that's fun. So you can fly around. And Optifine's really like an FPS booster. It makes everything run cleaner and and, and awesome for you. Let's see. What is it? Three? We got Optifine HD UA3 Vanilla. 30 frames per second. Depending on what you mess with, you can get that higher and higher. And it even says, oh look, it says NVIDIA Corporation GeForce GTX 750, which my new video card is going to be coming soon, so I'm kind of excited. I'm getting a um, 980 coming real So anyway, that doesn't matter. Thank you so much for watching. I'm sorry, I went off on a tangent. And Optifine works. If you have any questions, leave them below. If you have anything you want to talk about, any mods you want to see or help them get put in, leave the questions. I will answer them back. Thank you so much for watching. Until next time, peace! Turn all the lights on! Uh-uh.